Ouch. She's getting called here. It, it, this is it's yeah. very similar to to what to what uh, Bad Girl Fam did, isn't it? I mean, okay, it's like you kind of have to make these plays, but when they go wrong, they go wrong. <laughs> Do you know what? If Karma had nothing there, if she had a queen five and she'd raised it and Flanders went all in, we'd be sitting here saying, what a fantastic move that was. It's still a fantastic move. She's unfortunately ran into a monster, but this is what happens in poker. You know, you can imagine if Kyla had ace four, which she had last time, she really couldn't call here, could she? No, she had ace four. She'd be putting it down if she had king nine, king eight. Queen 10, 10 jack, all these hands should probably be laying down. It's a nice move by Flanders. It's an unfortunate move at this time because obviously she's ran into a huge hand. And it's a great spot for Kyla Kalmar. She will virtually double up. I think there's about 20,000 difference between them. She's got Pippa covered. But look how big this pot is. This is to take on Katie, basically. Uh-oh. Well, <laughs> she's hit a six. Yeah, we get, we heard uh, Kyla there saying typical. <laughs> yeah, she was always. <laughs> but she's got she's got the redraw outs. An ace or a king for Kyla, and Pip all of a sudden on the verge of doubling up. That's you. That's seventy seven percent. Wow! Look at this. This is turning into a great hand for Pippa. Kyla can't quite believe it. Lady Luck being a cruel mistress here. Kyla's going to be down to scatters. She doesn't hit the ace or king and the flush. The flush in the end. Flush. <laughs> yeah, we see it. <laughs> Kyla can't believe her luck here. How much is it? Pippa's even looks slightly bewildered by what happened there. Did I win, really? Well, is that with the thirty? Yeah. Yeah. And they need to Kyla win. feels very unlucky here, and she has been very unlucky. But uh, you know, as far as as far as Tip has happened. You saw those are the two ways to win. You know, you can either win before the flop, and if somehow you get your hand stuck in the cookie jar, you just get lucky. You know, live cards, you're really much more than about a 30% dog in these situations. She, she was pretty sure she'd have live cards there. She didn't expect the call when she went all in. Kyle is just going to be seething over that. Kyla's got a situation here, Michelle, and the situation is that she's got 21,000. Half of that fact is in for the big blind. Mathematically... She's in every time without a shadow of a doubt. Do seven? Anything. Do seven, the worst pre-flop hand in poker. You're still all in here. There's no laddering up in this game. Only the winner wins anything. So in that case, you're kind of better off not looking just because it might put you off. I wouldn't for fun. <laughs> I would much rather just get them all in oh, until I flip is, them over. This is not good. This is horrible for Kyle. I mean, first the ace-king being beaten so horrifically, and now she's so badly dominated. Would you begrudge her a bit of luck here? I mean, come on. Have a heart. <laughs> you kind of feel you want to see the two, don't you? It's only fair. Hello. And there it is. <laughs> Look at that in the door. And that's actually turned her into a massive favorite. Yep, the queen won't help. I need the jack for her. Close your eyes, Kyla, just in case. Three jacks out there. Is this going to be one of them? Nope. <laughs> See, she's even now. She w she lost one. She won one. I think she can afford to smile. Unlucky. It feels like Lynn's got the toughest sort of strategy call right now. I mean, Kylie's just got to shove him in um, with anything half decent. Lynn, it's, you know, her stack is a hundred now. If it gets to sixty, which is going to be kind of soon, she's like cut her chances Lynn. in half. Lynn. I like that. Oh. <laughs> and uh, cool. Cool. that's not what Kyla's cool. going to want to see no. in this hand. This is great no. for Lynn, though. No. no. Oh, Kyla showed, <laughs> she showed a lot of gusts. She, she kind of <laughs> felt like she might have some fold equity there uh, against Pippa, as it turned out. You're not getting anyone to put aces down, are you? 
the, you know, when you're sat there with aces as well, you desperately want somebody to either bet out or just go all in before you. And that's exactly what's happened here, Feline. It's fantastic for her. <laughs> oh, and would you believe it? See, Queen 2 is awesome. Uh -huh. This game's a little funny, Everyone's isn't it? Everyone's going to play that for an hour. <laughs> Lynn can't believe this. Yeah, we'll be here for an hour. This is the second time on the trot with Queen 2 for, for so Kyla. It's proving out to be a much better hand than... Me a king. Well, now a king. A king and ace. With Jack. <laughs> no, that wouldn't help. Nice Full game. house. Oh, Close. Okay. Uh, Lynn's taking it very well, isn't she? Jeez. <laughs> She's taking it better than I would be. And the situation, all of a sudden, Kyla's actually got more chips than Lynn, who... I mean, Kyla must be thinking about being back in this game. <laughs> Kyla even feels a little bit bad about that. You do in poker. You know that uh, you shouldn't... <laughs> You feel great that you won, but you you feel kind of bad. Hold it. Do you feel kind of bad, or do you pretend that you feel kind of bad? Yeah. We're women. Of course we feel bad. <laughs> We're nice to uh. each other, unlike you men. <laughs> Lines up to 7 and 15. For a heat that's kind of started off, I want to say slow, but sedate, it feels like there's all, all of a sudden a lot of play left in it from here. Or is that just wishful thinking? Is it just going to be bash and bang Raised right now? Total. Well, there's certainly play between Pippa and Katie if they want there to be. They can afford to see a few flops and try and outplay each other. The other two, Lynn and Kyla, I think it's going to be a bit more straightforward. Nice. King five just just isn't good enough. No, there's queen six really. But then I'm all in. Oh, look at this move from Katie. K Katie's making the move on Lynn that uh, that Pippa made on Kyla, that bad girl made on her. And what do you? Th why do you think she's done it here? Do you think it's she just realize feels that Lynn made a bet? She that, thinks it's a button steal. Yeah, that's what she thinks. That Lynn all of a sudden has enough chips to pass. And from Lynn's point of view, I mean, you don't you don't think Katie's making a move. So you think Katie's got a hand. I think in Lynn's position, you think Katie's ahead or you're in a race. So it's unlucky if it's a higher pocket pair. Right. You would never, ever believe that it was a situation like it is, which is that you're actually a huge favorite with the sixes. You're either up against over cards or an over pair, right? <coughs> yeah. I mean, she's in fantastic shape if she calls, but it's, it's a ridiculously hard call, which I don't think I could make. I really hope she can make it, but... Um, it's tough. It's kind of like the line at which you say to yourself, I actually have to get a little bit lucky to win this. She thinks if she calls, she's in a race, or she's seriously dominated by an overpair. Oh, good call. Has she call. made the I call? Made it is a good call. That's a great call from oh. Lynn <laughs> Beaumont. It is a good call. <laughs> and, <laughs> and this is a big <laughs> pot. And um, Katie's problem right now is that uh, she's only got one live card, not two. Lynn is in a great spot here to double up. Lynn is thinking it's her day off. She did not expect to see Queen Six in Katie's hand. And you have to give it to Katie. She did nothing wrong there either. She thought Lynn was on a button steal. It was a great gutsy move by Katie Hearn. But, you know, I mean, this... This has become sort of a heat where, um, you know, it's come down to all these ladies. They're trying so hard to win, yeah. you know, which is great. I mean, they're not letting the cards do it. We're seeing some fabulous play here. This is what we want to watch as viewers, and the queen doesn't come. Yeah. You're getting to watch. Yeah, Katie will be down to 40,000. And really, you, you know, you got to go out with your heart on your shield. I mean, it, it's a great gutsy move to make. And, uh, she, she said it just then. She said, you know, you raised the pot so many times. I thought you were at it. I yeah. made the move. It was a great move from Katie. It was, it was a great call from Lynn. Two yeah, very good plays. That's good poker. And it has really shifted the dynamics here because Lynn Beaumont is really the player at this table who has never had chips. She's <laughs> always been a bit under it. But what's she going to do with them? Well, I think she's one the other players didn't want to see have chips, to be honest. It's going to be oh, interesting nice to see how Pippa nice. deals with the, the large chip stack on her, on her right now. 
This raised a pip.